What's the crack lads? What's going on? Welcome into the channel early Thursday morning and we are going to be doing a quick weekly update and a roundup of everything that is new today. A lot of rinse and repeat as normal until the next big update. This will kind of be the way of it, but let's crack on with it, right? So we don't have anything in this authentic match. I like to go through this all the time, but we still have that on going for 40 days or so with the USL uh, authentic match event in here in Dream Team. I'll go through this quick video because if you're not at your console, you're not able to check. I want to bring you guys up to date. There is the new rinse and repeat uh, events here and the tour events and the matches and stuff. You've got your Japanese clubs. That's going to give you your free uh, player of the week national uh, November 23rd. That is going to give you your free, free player of the week spin when you complete that. You also have your coins one, so that's going to be the same one online. You just play that and you'll get your coins. On this, we are going to be still having this ongoing if you haven't completed this. And the main uh, reward in that is going to be XP and trainer XP and GP. Um, if you go there after 3,000 points, you get your skill trainers. That's still ongoing as well. And then, of course, we do have the new AI match. Uh, that is here and that is going on for six ma six days as well right so well all of these have been ongoing so it doesn't really make a difference when you complete them once you complete them before the timer goes uh, the user matches obviously are the same so these two are the same but these two are kind of new in terms of you can you can claim new rewards out of it right eFootball League is not going to be uh, I think another week and a bit before it releases all right or before it resets right so on to the actual couple of things that they have here added right or that they've kind of updated so we do have new distribution of leo meter rewards so these are uh for the rewards of scoring goals with Lionel messi right so as of right now everybody is going to have access to 50 million goals 100 million goals and 200 million goals uh rewards which are going to be 50,000 gp 30,000 trainer programs at 50 e-football coins right so the the period is ongoing uh, until that that date that you see there into 2024. So the more goals that are scored, the more stuff that we're going to get. So I eventually see just by proxy, we're definitely going to end up getting all of these rewards. I mean, these are essentially going to be login rewards because pretty much everyone is playing with Messi at the moment. And uh, yeah, it's so easy to score with him that this is just going to keep on going, right? But we also have a Black Friday sale added to the shop as well. So just to have a quick look at that in the eFootball Point store, you can see here that trainers are actually uh, reduced, right? So the players, there's no players. There's only two players left that I haven't got, Bebeto and Gareth Barry. The rest of them are going to be, you know, I've them gone, but there's like 132 days left in Bebeto there. He's the most recent one. Strips, there's nothing in that. But in the item section, you have this. So you can actually get five of these for a 1,000 eFootball points. So there are going to be 4,000 trainer programs. The rest of them are not on sale. Like So usually these cost 5,000, um, but now they're costing you know 1,000. So you're getting 4,000 off that. Listen, trainer XP lads is a bit of an issue at the moment. I'm going to do a video on that. Um, probably discuss it on my live stream as well. So onto the cards, as is probably the bulk of things here. As ever from the banners, we do have a couple of, um, you know, hints as to what they are, or not hints as to what they are, but kind of we get a, we get a look at them, right? And I'm also going to get a look at what's coming next week as well, uh, just to give you a quick a quick uh, sneak at that. We will do another video. You've got your J League monthly v MVPs, momentum dribbling on this guy here. Uh, we also have a selection of them as you see there. There's a, they're kind of mixed in with a box of 100. Um, I'm not even going to pronounce some of these names as or attempt to pronounce some of these name names. It's too early in the morning for me. Um, but listen. Uh, this is going to be one of these uh, players um, that you will want to look at, or this will be one of the packs that you'll want to look at if you're looking at getting squad players. But to be honest, let's look, and again, we'll discuss it. A lot of these are aimed towards newcomers. You know, they're not going to come in and shake up the foundation of your squad, especially players that only go to like 91, 92 overall. Not, not that overall means everything, but when you've got player of the week, that so you can get a free player of the week and you can get a bit of luck and get Diaz, he's probably going to outperform all of them. Now, I know that there will be a bit of more of a, a deep dive into it, uh, but we'll take a look at that. Speaking of Diaz, we do have a really good version of him. This is a whole player Diaz. This guy really excites me, interests me. Um, 91 dribbling, 85 tight possession, 80 finishing and then that speed and acceleration is whew, that's fairly fairly good lads it's a really good uh player they haven't fixed the manager issue uh yet but when they do this guy is going to be an absolute monster with nearly maxed out stats of where you need him right we also have a full selection of this um as i said i'll keep it as quick as i can ferran torres for fan is there nunez is there he gets another card quite recently so teammates get one there liverpool teammates uh the frige uh we also have lukaku uh we've got trezeguet darmian the booze, 
Uh, there's a lot of good players here. Moyle is there as well. Uh, there's a lot of good cards there. I mean, just to give a quick review of that, um, I would say that, again, these are always going to be players that you will look at to either strengthen your squad or for newcomers. There's nobody in here apart from Diaz. Maybe Nunes. He's fairly decent, but his balance is a killer, similar to a lot of the issues that these kind of tall, strong center halves have. They either have really, you know, nice player skills, but bad balance. Um, but the tight possession is also a bad one for him. Now, I'm sure that you'll be able to score goals with him, but we will get into that in our full review. Fafana looks pretty decent as well as an all-rounder if you've not got a player like that already, but you should have somebody better than that by now. We also have the South American club here. So again, you've got Cavani, you've got a, a few guys in there that are pretty okay, but it is geared towards newcomers. Now, these are in a limited box draw of 11, and they do cost coins. Uh, so for that, I would say that this is kind of a bit of a bust because these players are not going to change anything up unless they're doing specific events for these. Nobody is going to be using these players, and that's just the stone-cold truth, lads. Um, you know, I mean, they're a nice idea to have these different cards if they're your favorite players in here. Um, but I mean, in terms of actually wanting to win games, it's the same recycled, you know, 30-plus players or 30 or 40 players that you're going to be using every starting 11 selection. So these are also ongoing for another few days, 13 days, so two weeks' time. Uh, that's going to be a big date, I think. And then that's kind of it, Les. There's nothing really else ongoing there. You've got your still got your match pass that ends in 13 days as well. Um, you've got your boosters. You've got everything else that are pretty much the same. Um, you know, apart from a couple of the events or whatever, everything is pretty much the same. So I want to just give a quick look, right? So this is what's coming Monday. You're going to have be, have a Spanish league selection of attackers, which is coming on the 27th. Uh, you've got Shao Felix there. Uh, you've got a couple of other good players there as well. Um, as you can see there, as we cycle through them, right? You also have a special edition of Bellingham coming, Kubo and Alvar Alvaro Morata. Um, people are saying that this Bellingham is going to be an absolute beast. I will do a quick review on that or a breakdown of that as well in another video, not to make this video too long. And then we also do have on top of that as well, a Spanish League selection of Guardians here with Rudiger, going to be probably one of the most interesting players that we see here. You've also got Martinez, you've got Acuna Matata, as I like to call him. You've got a nice selection of players there as well. And then they have added a couple of new legends to the DB as well, uh, from what I could see. So you've got Puyol there as well, as have in, who else did I see? Uh, Ed Mielsen is there as well so it looks to be like a Spanish selection pack that would tie in and you've got Casillas young Casillas there he won't have 51 levels but I think that this Casillas could be a beast and it'll be nice to get Puyol, Puyol back as well Puyol is one of my favorite players I haven't used him in a long time don't know will I spin but we will have a full video on them as ever as well so that is it for me lads do not forget to like and subscribe we will be back streaming today just keeping you guys up to date with everything so I will talk to you in a bit